Hi guys, it's me, Kathy. This is Handy, are you? I hope you guys are doing really well. And we're getting through the summer together. Did you notice? We're getting there. So who knows if this fall is supposed to be something like I've been talking about. I could be 100% wrong. It could be five years from now. I don't know. <laughs> I just think we should be ready mentally and physically and you know with stuff get some peanut butter and crackers and some water you know <laughs> uh, anyway so this is from a little bit ago but uh, I haven't been doing videos as much as I should be let's be honest right uh, anyway so on July 29th Juan was on, Juan O'Savin was on with Jason Q, and he was on, uh, the show is called High Vibes Up, and uh, I don't think he's been on there before. I think it might have been the first time, so you might have missed it if you're not subscribed, and I think he's going back on there again, so I, you should subscribe, and Jason Q is very important to listen to. So I think it's a good idea. High vibes up. So this is what Juan said. <laughs> you know he's double, triple talking on and on, umpteen levels. I mean, way beyond what I know. This is what I got. So he was in the car as usual, but he wasn't driving. So that was different. And uh, he said, today someone else is driving. And I'm holding on for dear life. That was at 115. I'm holding on for dear life, right? And then he said, it's okay. This is at 117. He's, and I, well, I'm doing timestamps. And I don't know. I've got a little gematria, gematria in here. So in case you're new, gematria is A equals 1 through Z equals 26. And you can use all capitals from a paragraph or a headline. You can, um, like a truth social post from President Trump or anybody. Yeah, you can, what else? You can use a phrase. You can use a word. You can use your name. You can do whatever you want. And you can put in a question, which is what I've been doing a lot lately. You know, like, is Diana going to meet the beast? You know, that kind of thing. And it usually will help you. And then the, when you have the three choices of, let's see, the choices that will pop up after you enter this. Oh, you have to enter it in germatrix.org. And uh, that's what I do. And there's other ways of doing this. And they're not wrong. Uh, however anybody does it is fine. And you choose the third choice, which is simple gematria. And then it will come up with, uh, matches to what you entered and you listen to the Holy Spirit or however you want to call it God's talking to you angels whatever and then you realize you, you can write it down enter it in your phone whatever you feel like or just read it and um, after a while it tells you a story about different things that are going on or that you should know about okay so we got that out of the way so okay 117, and 17 is important because of our favorite Anon's uh, letter, the 17th letter. He said, it's okay. He was a fighter pilot. So he's trying to say there's a guy driving, but I don't think, I think it was a woman. And he was a fighter pilot, okay? He actually flew into real combat zones with real drama. In other words, real drama, like, He's telling you a story, you know, drama, story, not real. And fighter pilot, that's what you can look at. Well, not look at. He was Joseph Patrick Kennedy, J.R. or Jr. Uh, was a fighter pilot in World War II. And that's how he left the Earth plane. And he came back as our Jr., JFK, J.R., so let's see. He was reincarnated. That's what it is. So he was a fighter pilot. He actually flew into real combat zones, real drama. 
He said, I'm okay. And flying into a combat zone, I want to have control. And then he said, I'm not just pushing buttons. That's what happens when you get old. I'm not just pushing buttons. He's talking about the fake nuclear codes. That's what he's talking about, pushing buttons. And at 155, 55 for JFK, JR in simple gematria, he says, Jesus has the wheel. Okay. And immediately after he says, no, no, Jim's not here today because somebody might think it's Jim Caviezel because he played Jesus and he's a friend of uh, Juan's. Uh, he played it, um, I can't even think of the name of the movie, you guys, but you know, you know, Jim Caviezel, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, so he said, no, no, Jim's not here today. Well, no, and he said it twice, is Diana. I think Diana was driving, and I've got a feeling that they can only be together for the day, and they can't live together, and that's what I've been telling you guys lately. I mean, I can be wrong, but that's the way I keep hearing it. Um, he mentioned California. He's out in California, I think, and that to me, that's like the heads up for the big EQ earthquake that will look like it's happening. Um and he says, ah, all the time. Have you noticed that? I mean, I do too, but he does it on purpose. You know that, right? Every sound that he makes is on purpose. So he goes, no, I am uh, glad to do it. And ah, uh, believe it or not, is 29 and that's Diana. Okay. So that's why he's saying, ah, uh, all the time. <laughs> uh Ah, I did it. I said Diana. Hi, Diana. I haven't talked to her lately. I love you, Diana. How you doing? I know it's going to be really awful what you're going to go through, but I love you and I forgive you. And I'm sure that everybody watching this video forgives you because you were misled by the world's, the, 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 well, not the world, the most evil being ever, ever, ever anywhere. And you were persuaded and ca cajoled. And from what I get, Diana, I hope I'm, I'm not sure about this part, but that he made himself look like Hermes. Do you say it with an H or do you say Hermes? I don't know. Like a beautiful person, you know, and with that and all the stuff. And you, I don't know. I, I feel bad. I know God said, don't touch the tree you know, the fruit of the tree, and it, it was human DNA. I know that. But anyway, I forgive you. I'm not going to go into all the stuff. And I, I know that you have felt terrible about this forever. And I think Jackie is your twin. Well, she is your twin. The I, Even though you look different, you, you she's your twin. I still don't understand if Jackie is with you or not during all this so if anybody wants to let me know i really appreciate it in a comment or something <laughs> anyway i love you diana and i love you jackie you know we all love you anyway i didn't mean to go off off topic like that but then at 235 now 35 was important because jfk was uh POTUS 35. He said beautiful two times in a row. Um, beautiful. Uh, where is it? Yeah, I should know that by now. Beautiful is 97 and that's Jacqueline. So, hi Jackie. And you are beautiful inside and out. Um, and he said, I will tell you this. He said it two times quickly one after the other I will tell you this I will tell you this and that's just one time the letters all equal 231 and that equals the calm before the storm uh, and he talked about I'm sure everyone in this audience um, 
is alienated from family members and alienated. I mean, I didn't do alienated like I could have, but alien just makes me think of Pleiadians. I don't know if I said that right. And let's see. He said a lot of them are coming alive a couple minutes later. That was really funny. A lot of them are coming. He's talking about, you know, people that are like waking up and all. But he's a lot of them are coming alive. Like, yeah, literally. Um, and let's see. He said, your, but he, he kind of stuttered a little bit. He said, your, your, like your, your, like that. And he said, your, your, your people are willing to discuss things. And your is 84, Father God, Savior, and 5-5. Five, five. And 55 is JFK JR. So, whoa, look what else. Oh, I forgot this part. Um, it also matches Men in Black, which is uh, a reference to a movie that, you know, aliens coming to take over and all that. And Kronos, C-R-O-N-O-S, which I've seen it spelled a little differently, but it means the same thing. It was a god that ate its own little ones and anyway and leonardo matches so that's that's cool because i've already talked about leonardo da vinci and junior and all that um oh, i said um at 455 he said um <laughs> and that's 34 and that's d-day now you're gonna go why why'd you pick that um but it's uh it was at a 55 which is jfk jr so it's uh let's see d-day dark cold beheaded Ooh. i hope i got that right i might have said something wrong in there and don't kill me if i said something wrong sometimes i get things wrong you know that i do <laughs> i definitely get things wrong Ooh. uh let's see and then he started giving all these references to sailing and ships and things like that. And he said, the tide is going and it can affect the angle of the ship. Um, when it's at anchor, whichever which way the tide is going, you know, and uh, let's see, the ship will reorient itself like a weather vane. And um, the sail is catching and your fin in the water does something. I didn't write the whole thing because it's hard to keep up. And let's see, talk about hull speed, up current, down current, ground speed. The current is only four knots. The current, the current, the gun. Yeah, I should have done current. Why didn't I do current? <sighs> but anyway, it was a lot of sailing terms. And I've been saying that this beast event is going to happen while they're on some type of ship. And then he talked about people rising up and, uh, you know, to, to fight or argue about what's been going on. Rising up. And it makes me think of after the beast event, she or both of them or whatever rise up. I don't know if I'll ever know what's going on. You know, we'll find out together. I'm just giving the educated uh guesses based on decoding you know don't go and say oh mrs handy said this would happen because i i you know i don't know i really don't i'm just trying to figure it out just like you guys are um you talked about currency in argentina has collapsed so i'm you know collapsed like falling down after something comes after you and then he talked about the current again, the winds, the tide, everything's changing. You've been swimming upstream for a long time, and that has turned. It turned about four and a half months ago. Well, four and a half is 4.5, which is President Trump, 45, 45th POTUS. And uh, then at 7.15, he says, but it's accelerating now. In other words, I think it's because we're getting close to events happening that are more out in the open. I mean, lots of things have happened. You can't, you can't really say nothing's been happening, but lots of things have happened. But I think it, like he said, it's accelerating. 
and then he brought up conversations again and they said this is a numbers game well you know he doesn't tell you that you should decode him but he's honestly putting it right out there this is a numbers game you know it's it's getting kind of obvious that that that's what's going on at least i hope so to save the world and uh numbers just happens to equal 92 and it equals decode the end like accelerating getting to the end decode the end um leviathan which is another name for the beast in my opinion deep impact uh, worried cactus jack now i know that's just silly but it's got jack in there and the view you remember that, that awful tv show with Whoopi, who passed away recently from what i read yeah right and uh the view is going to be us having a view of what's happening and i think that it'll be the uh eclipse either the sun's turned off or who knows what's happening with the sun and it will be, we will have a very good view of what in heaven's name is going on. I think there's a beheading. I really do. I think I've told you before. It's going to be awful. Um, and what else can I tell you that he said? Yeah, is this something important? Yeah, in, the, in the, a couple of videos ago, I was talking about Juan calling in as um, Wayne Willott. And there's a lot of double letters in there when you write down Wayne Willott. And there, there's two W's, there's two L's, there's two T's. So that, that's not a coincidence. That's talking about twins. And then he called in as W. And so I decided to just try... Uh, w U D O U B L E and then the letter U in Jamatrix.org and it equals 80 and I you know I didn't know what it equaled when I put it in and that equals last call lady death tragedy Spencer like Diana's last name before the marriage and 80, 80 equals the beast. I don't think that's a coincidence. I really don't. Yeah. And after all this happens, it's I don't know at what point, but the way I'm seeing everything and coding and all that stuff, I really think that we're back at, to Eden after that. Um, it's not like I decoded that phrase, but I really feel like that somehow our DNA is upgraded, somehow we're healed all kinds of things it's going to be beautiful and it, just think about the positive stuff you guys think about the happy stuff um don't don't dwell on it's taken too long and my family thinks i'm crazy just think about happy things like when you're out and about if you see somebody you think oh my gosh that person's limping they won't be limping anymore you know or like you know, you see a house that's falling apart and you'll go, oh my gosh, they'll be able to fix their house. You know, think about the positive stuff like that. Um, that's what I do. And uh, another note I have is, remember Juan talked about murder on the Orient Express? And I can't remember if that was on one of the videos I got to do with him, but he said, anyway, he said, they all did the murder. And that's the plot of Murder on the Orient Express. There wasn't just one person doing this. There was a bunch of people involved. And um, you remember I did a whole video on Savinian, S-A-V-I-N-I-E-N, Caracostia, C-A-R-A-C-O-S-T-E-A. And he is junior and he has a magazine, mega magazine, and he's supposedly French. And um, he had that book on the back cover of one of the issues, at least one that I have. And uh, you can look up, just have to look up savinian.com. 
and you'll find the magazines and all kinds of interesting things. Sorry, you'll, all kinds of interesting things. Um, so he had it on his back cover, you know, and it's supposedly something that helped him get through the shut the, the shut down the um, quarantine, whatever you want to say, and that that was a book that helped him. And uh, it's also you can watch that movie with it's a Poirot movie. And you can watch it. I can't remember if it's on Acorn or like the British Channel. Oh, I can't remember, but you can watch Murder on the Orient Express somewhere. And uh, let's see. So he brought up they all did the murder. OK, stop and think about what he's talking about. He's not just talking about murder on the Orient Express. He's talking about at um, the Garden of Eden, right? When the tree, the, the, the fruit from the tree, the human DNA, that, that's what he's talking about. They all did the murder. All. All. All is all. You know? So I don't think, you know, for a while, you know, uh, even a few minutes ago, I was saying, oh, I don't even know if it's Jackie, but the twins, I mean, there was an Adam and Eve and then another one. And uh, definitely John and John were there and they're twins. They were twins back in the Garden of Eden. And, um, and uh, what, Diana and Jackie are another set of twins. So... Anyway, I don't know. And remember I talked about in a video recently that Jackie was a white rabbit. Diana was a white rabbit. From my questioning on jimmatrix.org, is, is Diana a white rabbit? You know, literally, I put that in. Um, so what was my point? Uh, yeah, I, I got to the point. I did. And I even entered, I entered, oh, you're not going to believe this. I entered, is Juan a white rabbit? And that's 192. And that equals, look past the flesh. Okay, flesh was in there. I mean, you don't see that. Murders, she wrote. That was a TV series, um, you know, quite a while ago. Murder, she wrote. Um matches is one or white a white rabbit if you didn't see that video is um someone that com consumes human dna that's what a way so when follow the white rabbit that's what that's what that means and jackie's name and i don't remember which way but jackie's name matches white rabbit i, I can't remember exactly what that is but uh okay so is one a white rabbit, 192, equals these people are sick, which is a 17th letter phrase. It's going to be biblical, another one that he had. No survivors matches. So we have look past the flesh, murder she, murder she wrote, no survivors. And responsibility, all this matches is one a white rabbit. And then the phrase that people say, you know, a lot of the phrases that we say now that are just like a slang kind of thing to say or a phrase, they're all put there by the white hats and they all mean something. Um, like, here's one. Nice. Are you kidding me? You know, like you'll go, oh, nice. Are you kidding me? And um, that matches 192 is one a white rabbit. Dual personality so we've got the good and the bad, dual personality. You stupid boy is 192. You stupid boy. Um, July 16th matches is one a white rabbit. July 16th was the date that um, Junior took himself out of the picture and was a supposed plane crash, remember? Um Never forgive them, which is not true, because we will. I mean, I have. I forgive you, John. I forgive 
I give, I forgive President Kennedy for the cross. I mean, I forgive everybody, right? And so there, there's no question about that. Um, and I know the truth. All this matches. Everyone hates him. And I think that that's one of the, um, I've already told you this, but that's one of the uh, 17th letter phrases. They won't be able to walk down the street. And I used to always look at that as, oh, the cabal, the bad guys, the people in politics, the whoever it is, they won't be able to walk down the street because you know what they did at the end. I think it's also them. I think it's also who we're talking about right now, like Diana and Juan, Jackie, John, whoever. Like I said, I don't know if I'm right, but that, that definitely could be. Um, everyone hates him. Never-ending madness. Like, like that's why it happened, because they went like temporarily nuts. Then we have, okay, so the question is, is Juan a white rabbit? 192. It equals St. Michael, the archangel. Um, that's who he is. He's St. He's Michael from before. Transgressors matches. Criminal operation and downright abominable. So that was a little intense, don't you think? I think it was a little intense. So, yeah, this was not a happy one either. So I tried President, is President, well, you can do it either way. Is President Kennedy a white rabbit? Or, of course, you just switch the words around. President Kennedy is a white rabbit. So it's the same value, of course. That's 334. And it equals, is unable to make sound judgments. They're about to find out who I am. Oh, God, none of it matters anymore. Literally, that's what it says. Oh, God, none of it matters anymore. Do you know right from wrong? Acting in a selfish and arrogant manner. And then we have 190, no, I'm sorry, 334 also. Beast will change world laws and time. Now, I thought that was fascinating because... Like I was saying, is uh, after the event, the beast event is how I phrase it. Well, I mean, it certainly sounds like from all the coding I've been doing that things are going to change. And here it is right in black and white. Beast will change world laws and time. And we, because Jesus didn't die and... Um, that's what would have put us, instead of under the law, that's the phrase you, you would use, because that's what they, they were under, under the law, then um, Jesus didn't die, so we were, we're still under the law, okay? And when the beast event happens, then we'll be back to where we should be, because at least a Jesus, um, Christ, it plural, whatever ends up happening, that will change everything, and then we're under grace. So then we're under the grace of God, not under the laws of God. It, I don't know if I'm making myself clear. Here, listen to this one. This is kind of funny. Um, 334, like I said, President Kennedy is a white rabbit, or is President Kennedy. Um, damn, you sure drag out issues. <laughs> These guys have such a sense of humor. Um, I can wait, but the pressure is on, matches. And they have not seen anything yet. So take that for what it's worth. I, I, you know, I don't know. Anyway, I want to say goodbye. And thank you if you donated or even watched, obviously. Oh, I mean, that makes a big difference. And... Uh, just thank you. Thank you in general for sharing the videos. Um, and I have playlists, you know. Uh, look on my home page, on my home screen or whatever. Look at the top categories and you'll see playlists. And a bunch of them are there that will help help everybody understand because it's kind of like a theory developing and you kind of see where it's going about Juan and President Trump and um, 
junior, all that. So thank you guys. And uh, my, my links are under the video description. So if you feel led to donate, thank you. And uh, don't feel like you have to though, just if you feel led to. And um, I love you guys and take care of each other. And um, just try not to worry. You know, don't worry. Like remember Jesus said so many times, don't be afraid, do not be, do not fear, all that. So don't be afraid and um, I'll see you soon. Love you. Bye.